The best new apps can be a little tough to find with new apps releasing every single day, but don't worry. Today, I'm going to tell you the absolute coolest new Android apps of 2022. And yeah, these apps have launched in 2022 and you need to check them out. Before we start, I want to give a huge shout out to Spigen, our sponsors for this video. Spigen recently launched a super cool 3-in-1 wireless charging 10,000 mAh power bank. 3-in-1 because 1, you can use it in your home as a wireless charger like this. Two, you can use this as a phone stand at your office desk. And third, you can use it as a wireless charging power bank. And there's even multiple ports here. This supports up to 15 watt wireless charging, 20 watt USB PD charging, and it costs 2,599 on Amazon. So check it out from the link below. Let's be honest, when you see home screen setups like this or this, you want to set up your home screen the exact same way, right? Enter palette home screen setups. See, this app is basically the stop for people who want a beautiful home screen. You can swipe through all the cool home screen setups here. You can sort them by latest, oldest, or most viewed. And you can also see setups based on different categories like AMOLED, minimal, etc. Now, I like this minimal home screen setup, so I can just tap on it and I can see all the information below. I need Nova Launcher, the Minimal Low Icon Pack, and the KWGT Base Pack. Now, what's cool is that you can tap on these to go to the Play Store directly and just get downloading. Plus, there's also the Nova Launcher backup file for easy setup, and I can just tap on wallpaper to download it right away. Yeah, this is pretty easy, and yeah, this is something you like. Physical notification LEDs are kind of dead right now, but Notification Light is an app that brings a notification LED, sort of, to your modern day smartphone. See, this puts a notification LED to the punch hole camera on your phone. Yeah, this is how it looks like when your phone gets a notification. Pretty cool, right? Plus, I love how customizable this is. You can change the color of this light. In fact, you can set specific colors for specific contacts and apps. You can change the animation. You can choose between pulse, rotate, or gravity in the free version. There are a lot more options, and I like the fact that this works with the always-on display feature on almost every smartphone, so it's not draining too much battery. Don't worry, there is a separate app for phones with no AOD that I will be linking below, so check it out. So sometimes you want to take a before and after photo of maybe your fitness transformation or maybe your house renovation, or maybe you want to take a photo in the exact same pose as one of your previous photos. Detoad is an app that lets you do exactly that. In this app, you can select a photo from the gallery and Detoad will put it as an overlay in the camera viewfinder like this. You can increase or decrease the opacity of the overlay and then you can align things and take the exact same photo once again. This is handy, right? Now, the cool thing is the app also has some interesting templates to put as an overlay and then take a photo just like the template. A lot of Android UIs have this sidebar feature which lets you access the apps really quickly from the home screen. Well, Edge Card Launcher is that but on steroids. The Edge Card Launcher can be accessed by swiping up on the left edge or the right edge. And this brings a number of quick options in one go. There's obviously the apps, but there's also music controls here, the battery percentage, the volume panel, and there are these shortcuts to the notification shade, auto rotate, etc. You also get the second page with contacts on it. Plus, I like that you can pick and choose the apps you want to see here and even the contacts. Now, most of the features here are free, but if you want things like unlimited apps, gestures from both the sides, you will have to get the pro version. Widget Share is the next cool new app on the list, and this lets you have the exact same widget on your phone, your friend's phone, and your family member's phone, basically anyone, and it's pretty cool. Let me show you. So here I have set this photo as a widget on my home screen as well as the home screen on another phone. Now I can change the photo in this widget and the photo on the other phone will also change like this. This is awesome, right? I mean, it does not happen instantaneously as the developers claim, but it's still pretty good. Anyway, you can select a photo from the gallery or take a photo from the app and you can even doodle or write things on the photo to make a nice sweet widget that is maybe shared across your family. See, AirPods don't really play well with Android smartphones, but if for some reason you have an Android phone and you have AirPods, you need the CA Pod app. So this is a pretty simple app, but it brings a lot of AirPods features on Android. First, it shows you the battery details of both the earbuds and the case. It also detects if any earbud is in the ear or not. Plus, there are these super handy options. You can turn on autoplay and auto pause to make sure the audio playback is controlled automatically. There's also auto connect in case you're having issues connecting the AirPods to your Android smartphone. Lastly, the app brings a pop-up similar to iPhones to show you the battery status of the AirPods. Now, this did not work for me, but it's marked as experimental, so maybe it'll work in the future. Anyway, you do get this notification to see the battery details of your AirPods. So we've all seen a lot of cool weather apps in the past, but let me tell you that Dina or D-I-N-A is the coolest weather app ever. So Dina shows you the weather details like any other weather app, but what's cool about this app is that it tells you what you should wear depending on the weather forecast. It also tells you if you need to take an umbrella or sunscreen once you head out. You just need to add these details here like skin type, your height, weight, and it will show you what you should wear like this. 
Plus, as you can see, it's also telling me to get a sunscreen because I will experience sunburn, obviously, Delhi. I can tap here to see more details. And yeah, this is kind of useful, right? So those are some of the coolest new Android apps and comment below your favorite app from the list. Comment below if there's any other new app that we missed out on. Comment below if you want a video on iPhone apps because I know it's been some time. And lastly, give this video a like, make sure to share it and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tech videos. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. You can burn hundreds of calories playing these video games. You heard it right. This is the Oculus Quest 2 and this is my...